For the purposes of this video, we will be using data compiled by San Diego County, but the numbers are similar across all of California and indeed, all across the country. Senior homelessness is on the rise. A report ordered by the State of California Department on Aging in San Diego reports that as of September 2021, there has been an increase in homelessness among people 55 and older. About 25% of the homeless population is over 55 years old. In fact, 43% of the population of homeless people over the age of 55 are experiencing homelessness for the first time in their lives. There are apartments available for the over 55 population that building owners offer at a discount for seniors to get the tax breaks. There is also Section 8 Housing Choice vouchers available to them as well. The problem though, is that most people do not know about these apartments nor the voucher program. The information about them is also not readily available unless they go seeking help. By then, it's usually too late. Another thing too, is that there is usually a waiting list for the apartment and the vouchers, but depending on the individual circumstance, a person can skip the waiting list and go directly into an apartment depending on certain criteria put in place by the agencies. Let's look at the problem from the beginning though. The social security system was put into place by law in 1935 as a means to force people to save some money for retirement. There is a problem with that though. If you made low wages throughout your life, as many of the current seniors have, then your social security check is going to be at the low end. Another problem is that the system was not well thought out in relation to inflation. That brings us to another problem with the raises that social security recipients get to try to keep up with inflation. It has the social security system at risk of going broke. So, those getting the lower end of the spectrum on the social security checks are already low income, but in a state like California, the rents keep increasing and are unaffordable by seniors in most cases. The annual increases of the base social security check is not enough to cover the ever-increasing costs of housing, utilities, and food. That's where senior citizens need to be educated, so that they can learn about the various programs available to them to survive in a state like California. These services include housing assistance, utility assistance, food stamps and other government programs. What seniors need to do, before paying rent ever becomes a problem, is to register for one or more of the housing projects directed at seniors in order to get their name on the waiting list for one of those apartments. While in most cases you will not need a Section 8 Housing Choice Voucher for those apartments, you should also register for the Section 8 Housing Choice Voucher Program as well. When you register for the Housing Choice Voucher Program, it takes a little while for the packet to be completed and all approvals obtained. This is streamlined for senior citizens and veterans, but it still takes some time to complete the application. Once you are approved, you will have six months to find an apartment to move into. If you don't find an apartment in that time that is suitable, you will have to apply all over again. Seek assistance when doing your search. We have included a link here for you to click that will take you to a page that includes the information in this video, and any links that you will need to get forms, websites and any other information you will need. Your worker will be able to assist you in finding out anything that you need to know about your situation. While the information given here is specific to Riverside County in California, you can use similar search for your area using the keywords we provide in the article that this video links to.